Today we scratch print in the train station. This is the Denver Union Station Project Series Part 5. We're glad you're here. Well. Hey, this is Brian with the Iron Horse Route Home with the Denver and Rio Grande Western. Welcoming you to the channel in our Denver Union Station Project Series Part 5. We scratch printed this guy right here. We designed it in Tinkercad and then we scratch printed it using Cura and an Ender 3. And we welcome you to part five of the series. If you have not seen any of the first four parts, I only encourage you to follow this card right here, right now. It is a playlist card that'll let you play the series in sequence in its entirety. It'll catch you right up to here and then let you play this part as well. All right. So what we're doing today in our last uh, episode, we did building one. Uh, part four was a uh, in-depth uh, view of how we built building one. Building five is identical to building one, so we didn't do another episode for that. And today we are going to focus on our work on the back. And none of this is together yet. So we're working on the back now. We have to put some track in here. We have some um, roof overhangs as coverings for the passengers. There's a lot of snow in Denver. We're going to run some track and some ballast in here. We've got to do some road lines in here as well. And then we're going to come in with our tunnel pieces. And I got more to show you about that because we're going to be implementing all these pieces into the back area as well here. We're looking forward to showing you more about that now. And so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to move the camera from here over to here where you do you can get a view of me working. I'll try to stay out of the way and um, we'll get some clips of me doing the back. All right, so the good looking paint is what AJ did and the bad looking paint is what I did. And so this is all drying and it will fit right in and around our Denver Union Station and make us a parking lot scene for the front. We're gonna get some stairs coming in down here. Um, we'll 3D print them as well. Following, we've been cleaning the track. Come down here, you will see we've been working on the back, back here. This is going to be a road scene back there, and your tracks in the back.
Alright, so what we're doing now is we've got ballast track down and ballast down uh, glued on it and we're going to let that dry. While that's drying, we got to paint the inside of these tunnel portals and so that's what we're going to do next. We're going to turn the up overhead camera on and we're going to paint these tunnel portals. And then once they're dry, because we got a light to go in a couple of those, and once they're dry, then we'll be gluing that down. We have some road stripes that we probably need to go ahead and put in here as well before we glue that down while we're painting. <laughs> 